Hey guys, it's your Inner Chakras. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for all your likes, your comments, your subscribes, your shares. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you to all my day ones. Thank you to everybody. Guys, my, um, what do you call it? My charms, some more charms came in the mail. And these are just the letters. So because I'm downstairs, I'm going to just pull, I put them in my little bowl. And we're just gonna see if I can pull the initial of your Divine Masculine or your initial or their zodiac sign or anything that relates you back to this person. So I'm just gonna pull a few just to see whose energy is this. All right, we got a Q. I don't know. Maybe your person was in a fraternity. Maybe he's a Q dog, <laughs> you know, I don't know. I don't know where that came from, but maybe he is a Q dog. Uh, T. Maybe a person's name starts with a T. Last name T. Maybe your name starts with a T. We have an E. I'm going to pull five, okay, guys? I'm just going to pull five of them. We got an E. We have an R. Maybe that's somebody's name. First name, last name, horoscope, anything. All right, what's this? This is five. So we got two E's. Tree? Did y'all hang out in a tree? <laughs> Is he, does he call you cutie? Is his name Trey? Do you call him T for nickname for short? Do you call him R? Do you call him E? You know, everybody got a nickname. Is he a Taurus? Is he E or excited? <laughs> All right, guys. So there we go. So we got five. Five energies. Somebody's energies. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. So what's going on with these masculines? was already flipped on up. All right, guys, so this is your situation. Let's just see what's going on, what's taking place, what you can't see or what you can't see. Like, what are you doing right now? What's coming down the pipe, spirit? It's coming down the pipes for the collective, spirit. Whose story is this? Help me deliver a message, spirit, to somebody. Community. It can involve a family. It's definitely involving some things, right? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What is this involving? A gift? So somebody's coming bearing gifts, maybe. Somebody's, oh, no, 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 no. Or this could be the message. Okay. Sudden wealth. Let me slide these over here. Sudden wealth, lover's pathway. Okay. So there it is. It looks like you and this masculine are coming together. Maybe you and your person. Or maybe your, your person has a community, has a family. And they see you as the gift. Maybe you're this person's gift. Maybe this person has to walk away from this family, this community. But whatever it is, within that gift, there could be some sudden wealth. Maybe, maybe you're going to win the lottery. Who freaking knows? But whatever it is, you're happy and you're together. Whatever it is you're happy and you're together, maybe your abundance and your wealth is going to come together when you come together. Maybe the gift is the two of you coming together. But once you come together on that pathway, you're going to be skipping down this road together. You got butterflies and stuff falling behind you. So you're going to be skipping down. It almost looks like the yellow big road. It's definitely golden. That's for sure. All right. What else, spirit? Let's put some tarot on this. We got community. We got gifts, sudden wealth, lover's pathway. All right. Holy Spirit, holy angels. What is going on, spirit? We want to clarify this message for the collective. What is going on? What's heading their way? Spirit, clarify this community card. Spirit, clarify this community. Let's see. Mm, so there's a lot of secrets about that community. There's a lot of hidden secrets about that family there. Divine Feminine is probably something you don't even know about. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What are some of these secrets that this film can't see? Huh. So your King of Cups has a family you may or may not know it but your king of cups have a family he's just not being very supportive in that family or he's not being supported within that family holy spirit holy angels clarify this moon and this king of cups in reverse spirit nine of swords that was nothing but depression a lot of secrets it knocked your person down it knocked somebody down a few pegs but they're coming out of it now this is on the other side of it so they're coming out of it 
Holy Spirit, what happened within this community here? These cards, goodness. It looked like there was a lot of stress, a lot of anguish, being unsure. I don't know if your person removed themselves from the situation. Because they're just kind of like, I'm over it. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, clarify this gift. What is with these cards? So there's an ending there. Was the, is the ending within the gift? Was the ending, was the gift by walking away? Yep, that was the gift. <laughs> the gift was walking away from his family. Wow, that was the gift to this masculine. So masculine found out some secrets that happened within his community here that put him in a state of depression for a little bit. But then he, he woke up and he, he's like, I can't stay here. I can't stay down and out and depressed. So he's coming out of it. And his way out was to put an end to it. So that was his gift. His gift from the universe was opening up a door to give him a chance to put an end to a, to a situation. He did. He put an end to a family situation, not necessarily the kids, but probably the mother. Probably the mother, the grandparents, anybody else that's involved, that got their mouths in it, that's involved in it. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what comes with the sudden well? And y'all know after endings come new beginnings. So you get an ending and then all of a sudden you're going to get a gift and some sudden wealth. What is the sudden wealth spirit after this ending here? What is the sudden wealth? And where is it coming from? The sudden wealth is coming from abandoning this path. Spirit said once you walk away from this situation here, that's when the sudden wealth is going to come. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yeah, Spirit said you can't stand there. You can't stay in that one spot. Spirit said you got to make a move. So Spirit said your sudden wealth will come once you make a move. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yep. There's hope here. Spirit said be hopeful. Because I keep asking about this sudden wealth, but Spirit is not telling you whatever it is. But he said be hopeful. Spirit, I'm going to ask again. <laughs> Spirit, what is this sudden wealth? I really don't want to push the button. All right. Here we go. You got your answer. Here we go. Spirit said, if you want sudden wealth, you have to end something. Spirit said, if you want this sudden wealth, you have to put an end to something. You have to let the tower fall. You have to let the tower fall in this community situation over here. You have to let it go. You have to let it go. Whether this is you or your person, you have to let it go. There was nothing but mental anguish there. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what is this lovers here? Six of Wands. This lover's this victory, guys. Spirit is telling you, let go of all that. Let go of it. Spirit said you have to put an end to this family, this fake family, this light family-ish. You know, maybe you're living like families. Maybe you're living like you brought your two families together. Not necessarily having your children together, but you're living like a family. Maybe you are living with your family. Maybe you're living with brothers and sisters, you know. That could happen too. Maybe it's just time. Time to go. Yeah, it is. It's time to go. It's time to go. You want everybody to get back. No more obstacles, no more nothing. You want everybody to get out of your way. Like, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Like, you're tired of fighting. You're tired of fighting to getting to this love. You're tired of fighting to get to this victory. What else? Yep. You tired. You don't want to give to anybody else. You don't want to celebrate with anybody else. You want one lover. That's it. Look, here's this karmic. Karmic won't let up, though. Karmic never stops. Do it. Karmic's never stop. Karmic's never stop. Spirit said make a decision. Spirit said make a decision. The karmic is going to watch. The karmic will continue to watch you. Watch you, the divine mask, and whoever. These karmics will continue to watch. All your exes will continue to watch. You know why? Because you left them. When you leave someone, it kind of messes them up in the head. So they're going to continue to watch you to see how you do. But if they left you, they wouldn't give two shits about checking on you. 
okay? Remember that. The only reason why they're checking on you is because you left them, okay? So they're watching, but Spirit said do something. Spirit said make a decision. You gonna stare at this dartboard all year? You gonna stare at this dartboard all year is what Spirit said? Once this justice is served, you and your master and you and your person can get on this pathway to happiness. Yeah. Y'all can get on your way. Ten of Pentacles. To either building something, he needs to end it. He needs to end it. This Ten of Pentacles here. With that family, which he is. He's walking away. He's leaving the inheritance. He's leaving the money. But he wants to start from the ground up with you. And this is a rebuild. It's a knockdown with the family. It's a rebuild with you. All right, guys, what else? This is it. Spirit said do something or you're going to be stuck on this karmic will for a while. All right, divine feminines or divine masculine, this is for you. Spirit said you either have to walk away from that family, community, whatever it is that's holding you back, or you're going to be stuck on this karmic will again, probably for another 10 years. See the 10? You're going to be stuck for another 10 years. Spirit said if you want this new love, you want this page of cups. You have to step away from this community. You have to step away from what you think is your life. That's not your life anymore. Peter, Paul, and them. Peter, Paul, and them done got married. Tracy and all of them, they're married too. It's your turn now. Stop hanging out on the block. Who's left on the block? You? Get off the block. Get off the block and get your life, period. That's the message for somebody, if you want this empress. Get off the block. Get off the block and go get your life. All right, guys. Do something. I don't know. All right, guys, thanks for watching. <laughs> this is somebody's reading. It'll resonate with somebody. I know it will. I know it will. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.